Hey, what's going on guys? Chris here with TechRecipes.com and today I'm going to show you very quickly how we can download jQuery and uh, link it in our HTML file so we can start using it. And in further tutorials down the road, I'm going to show you guys exactly what we can do with jQuery and what it is. But first, let's get it uh, set up and installed. So you're going to want to go to jQuery.com and right on the home page is where we're going to download it. Now you want to do the production one here because it's minified and it takes up less space on your server. I mean the difference isn't that much but uh, you don't really need the development one right now. Let's go with the production. So select production and click download jQuery. You're going to see this big screen with all this text that doesn't make any sense. What you want to do is just save the page and I'm saving it to the desktop and I like to call mine jQuery.js and make sure it's saving as JavaScript source code and let's minimize that, minimize that and you'll see we have jQuery.js here and that's the jQuery uh, library but now we have to do uh, link it, I'm sorry, in our HTML document so we can start using it so here's my basic document and in the head is where I'm going to link to jQuery and it's almost just like linking to an external uh, CSS style sheet or anything of that nature so we're going to go script type equals text slash JavaScript and we got to give it our source and we'll just assume it's in the same directory as this HTML file and we do have to close this out though uh, with the script 